10 of Lex 2005 karaoke in English and now we are going to do uh, the recording for group discussion one uh, but first let us introduce ourselves okay my name is Norati Kabit Yusuf and my matrix number is 190043 my name is Eliadi Nazira binti Ahmad Farid and my matrix number is 189819 my name is Nur Shafika Bindi Zulkifri and my metric number is 190124. Uh, my name is Nur Hidayu Binti Abdul Kadir 179636. My name is Shazwani Afza Binti Muhammad Fauzi and my metric number is 190447. Okay, so <coughs> as we are told, in this video, we are going to give some suggestions on the song that we are going to sing, which uh, will be conducted in uh, karaoke session 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, do you guys have any ideas of what song we are going to sing? So, who's going to suggest first? Katika, okay, do you yeah. have suggestion? Okay. <laughs> I have suggestion. <laughs> I have <laughs> a suggestion. Uh, this song uh, the, uh, is the climb uh, by Hannah Mo by Miley Cyrus. Oh, you guys I know about it. Yeah, yeah. Hannah yeah. Montana. <laughs> Hannah Montana from Hannah Montana. Hannah Actually, Montana. I grew up from this song. Not uh, only you, but us too. <laughs> <laughs> because it really inspires me. Uh, I heard this song since I was standard five, and I always listen to this song, especially before we take UPSR examination, right? So it really inspires me to, to, climb. Uh, to, <laughs> to climb, to work really hard so that I can achieve great result. So from actually from the lyrics, it's actually very meaningful because uh, from the lyric itself, so I will read the lyric for you guys. So there's always gonna be another mountain. I'm always gonna make it move. Always gonna be an uphill battle. Sometimes I'm gonna have to lose means that um, we are going to face more difficulties and opportunities in our lives. The climb itself um, actually illustrates our struggles during uh, facing the obstacles. And the mountain itself actually illustrates uh, things that happen in daily, life. uh, in daily lives, like uh, in hardship. hardship. So actually this song about uh, not not actually um, to achieve se successful, successful. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it it actually uh, the phase throughout to achieve throughout the, the journey, uh, throughout the journey achieving uh, in achieving something. So actually, it doesn't really matter if you actually get what you want, you reach your goal or not. It's actually the experience that you gain throughout. So so that like in future even though you have something that uh you once you you don't achieve at least you can learn from the past so you will face forward so you will be brave more because you have experience a lot of experience gain experience something like that okay. so uh, any suggestion mm. may i say something about your song yeah sure um actually i really love the way you describe the song it's really meaningful and yes very beautiful lyrics but I have to express my concern about the song I think the song has very high pitch and it's a bit hard to sing for us since we are not professional so yeah don't worry so <laughs> but it's a nice song it's a nice song it's a very, very nice song motivation yeah. don't worry I have a very monotonous <laughs> tone but I can so sing the song I can so sing <laughs> sing the song <laughs> sing the song sing the song okay. so Next. So, um, I'm going to suggest one song. Mm -hmm. okay. It is the uh, the title is "Count on Me" by Bruno Mars. I think everyone have heard it. Yes. And I think there is no need to explain the what the content of the song. Mm -hmm. But let me give a brief about it. Uh, for me, as I reflect it, I think it more about friendship mm -hmm. and maybe a little bit about, about our family about how we rely to I mean who we can rely on in our daily lives and in anything that we do we never going to make it alone there's always somebody or maybe a group of friends of us behind our success and uh, when I'm 
feeling happy, I will think of this song and I really really love it. Do you? Like, do you yeah, yeah. yeah. I love <laughs> song. Actually, um, recently I sang that song for my friend. Oh, so oh. sweet. Recently, oh. yeah. <laughs> so I think that it reminds me of the hardship that I faced, mm. just quite similar to that song, um, and how there's someone to, uh, always be there for us to help us, and in return. Uh, when somebody help us, we also we must always be there to help our other friends. Mm -hmm. So yeah, do you have yeah. any other? I think it's also easy to sing. I think much easier. Yeah, it's really so it's know. flat. It's yeah. not very high pitch. Mm -hmm. So we can sing this song in our style. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Okay, uh, I want to suggest one song. Mm -hmm. uh, this song, I I think not many uh, people know this song. This song is by Sarah Barrels. Mm -hmm. uh, the title is Brave. No, I've never heard. I've never heard that. Well, <laughs> the song is very catchy and has mm -hmm. positive vibe on it. Uh, as as you can see, the title itself, Brave. So mm -hmm. it's uh, the. The song is uh, it encouraging people to stand up, to speak what you want to speak. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, I, I read at the YouTube comments below, below the songs that everybody have difficult uh, likes. They are shy in the class, they are afraid to talk to people. So after they, uh, after they watch, uh, watch this uh, song and uh, interpret the meaning. They feel like the uh, the meaning is very deep. I want to uh, pick some chorus of the song, mm. which is it say that say what you wanna say and let the words uh, fall out. Honestly, I wanna see you be brave. So uh, you don't need to be afraid. You just need to speak up. Just uh, express what what you feel. And then be brave to uh, speak to another people and be, and have many friends. So this song is actually about let others know about our opinion, mm -hmm. so that people won't step on us. <laughs> this song okay. is actually uh, like a theme song for a for a bully. Mm. Like people bully that they, they feel depressed. Victims. Uh, they uh, they uh, didn't have friends to talk about their feelings, so this song is encourage them to speak, speak up, to speak up. Yes, maybe we will listen to it later. Yes. The song is very catchy, so it's very easy to 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 get it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. So next, I will also, I will also uh, like to um suggest a song. This song. Make me, I really fell in love with this song because it keeps on playing in my head. Basically, <laughs> uh, the first time uh, I listened to it, um, the song, the title of the song is um, "City of Stars." Uh, it's from a movie, La La Land. Have you ever watched it? Uh, no, I haven't watched it. No, I just forget about it. But um, the singers, I. Um, Emma Watson oh. uh, and um, Gary Gosling, if I'm not mistaken, and the song is about um, the love itself. Everyone, it described that love is that is something that everyone needs. S but the main reason, the f uh, the reason that I chose this song because it's really easy to sing for for everyone. Anyone can sing it because it's so it's slow. And it's like monotone, I think. Melo, melo, melodrama, 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 melodrama. And it's um, also catchy at the chorus. Mm -hmm. Maybe we listen to it later. Is it a, lo a love song? Yeah, a love song. Uh, it's described that um, everyone in this world, whether love with uh, love for our mothers or for, or for our families, we need it. So. It's I mean, not only I mean, love to our so uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Someone special, okay. So okay. it's actually universal. Yeah. yeah. You can apply you can apply to family and mm. everyone else.
Although I ne- uh, never listened to that song, but from your explanation, I think it's good because it is. You say it is easy to sing because I'm not a good singer. <laughs> oh, so yeah, yeah I think yeah. I'll consider it. <laughs> That's the point. My song is easy too. <laughs> <laughs> you can consider so, it. Well, Okay, um, I think that's a very good suggestion. However, I I have um, one suggestion. It is um, the song is entitled "The Fight Song" by Rachel Platten. Yeah. Um, as you can see by the title of the song, "The Fight Song," it really give the message for us for to be to know that someone will be there for you. As we can see from the lyrics itself, um, by singing this song, you you finally tell people that this is my fight song, take back my life song, prove I'm a right song, which prove that you are strong enough to face the world, to face the bad things, all the bad things that people say about you. It's like my song, be brave. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, it's quite similar. similar. Yeah. That's a good song. I like mm. this song. Yeah, it's this catchy. Is my, yeah, okay, very good. But still, it's a very high pitch song. Yeah. As well. <laughs> it has a good message, but we can. There's a lot of chorus, right? Yeah, a lot of chorus. Yeah, repeating chorus. Repeating chorus, yeah, right? Repeating chorus. Uh, if it's repeating chorus, mm. okay. <laughs> <laughs> so okay. how so do yeah. we want to decide the song? So Shall we vote or <laughs> vote? I think vote. it's better to vote. <laughs> okay, so we have chosen four songs, mm. which yeah. are "Count on Me" by Bruno Mars, yep. "The Climb," Climb. Uh, "Ray," and five. five songs. So, so these are the songs that we choose. So when are we going to do the first target session? Uh, maybe we have to discuss in WhatsApp group first because yes. I think we all have like we cannot set the date now because because we, we need to check uh, our schedules first. Yeah, so we are so busy. Mm. Mm. So maybe really? next time. Uh, <laughs> but which song is um with our oh, first the first song, song. Oh, yeah. Yeah. second song, third song? So we should choose the easiest one first, right? Uh, okay. The <laughs> the, the, the highest vote. The highest vote. All right. So okay. The song Mm, okay, yes. follow from the highest to the lowest vote. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, easy, easier. Ah, easier. So that's all for that. today, right? Okay. Mm. okay. See, See you next time. time. See you next time. Bye.